Police believe the suspects behind the pharmacy break-ins are selling the stolen pills to drug addicts on the black market. Addicts pay as much as $50 for one pill to feed their addictions. But as News finds, Pat Peterson reports there is help for them. Treatment is affordable. John is a recovering drug addict. 20, 30 lore tabs a day. John agreed to talk to us about his prescription painkiller addiction and how it destroyed his life if we protected his identity. Eventually found my way to snorting and, and even shooting uh, oxycodone, oxycontin, morphine. John was spending hundreds of dollars a day on his addiction. And then once I got up to the, higher, the stronger pills, I was taking less pills but spending more money on those pills. I mean, you're talking about pills that go for $50 a pop. And I'm taking three, four a day. I'm spending $100, $200 a day sometimes. Obviously, I was doing bad things to get that money, though. Ended up in jail with a number of charges. John finally hit rock bottom and asked for help. He soon found out treatment was a lot cheaper than feeding his addiction. I think it's $150 a week here um, compared to $1,200 I was paying. I mean, that's 10 times more to be out there using than it is to, to get help. There's affordable help out there. Um, there's help locally. Just make the phone call. At the shoulder in Spanish Fort. Our outpatient program is about $30 a session, and that's for two hours. And our inpatient residential treatment is about $147 a, a week. Both inpatient and outpatient treatment options are cheaper than supporting an addiction. A lot of our clients check in here without a dime to their name. So we allow them to get a job, to establish some income, and then begin to pay for treatment. And that's a big part of what we do here at the shoulder to be able to help everyone in the community. So your disease is always as smart as you are. You can't outsmart it. So the best thing to do to cause the least damage is just to call somebody today. Now, for-profit high-end treatment centers obviously cost more. Some can run as much as 20000 a month. And one other important note, Roseanne, many health insurance plans now cover drug treatment addiction and will pay 60 to 80 percent of those medical costs. Live on the Baldwin County Beat, Pat Peterson, News 5.